Yo, what's up? It's your boy Pac Jr. And what I got for you guys today is one of the best cover three bombs out of the Carolina Panthers playbook. Now we are in the Carolina Panthers tour. So go ahead and check the playlist and see we have the West Coast tour, we have the Carolina tour. This next particular scheme is going to involve a couple of plays that are really, really money. Now they're awesome to run in regs, or sorry, they're awesome to run in CFMs if you have it, but obviously in mud, you can get really creative. So we're gonna talk about a cover three bomb that a lot of people don't expect when you run this formation. So let me show you what I'm talking about. All right, the play that we're gonna take a look at is this ace double wing. Now, honestly, you can try to get somebody faster. Obviously, I'm gonna put a halfback right here. So I'm gonna put Matt Breida because he's 95 speed, but you can obviously play around with how you want it. I'm gonna keep Lamar Jackson in for now. And you can audible to just, you know, heavy Panther. Um, you already know, I don't need to go over this, but the QB blast is money. Uh, we have the mesh sit, which is also money. And then last but not least, this tight end spot. So this right here and ace double, wi double wing are some very, very good formations to take advantage of. The play that we're mostly going to cover, team, is going to be this PA, uh, PA counter waggle. And there's a lot that we can do with this. And this tight end shake right here is also really good. And we got this tight end corner route. So th this formation is actually really, really glitchy. But I wanna show you some cover three bombs out of this. So you're gonna hit this play. Let's come out in a cover three. Okay, I actually went ahead and put my homes in just because he has dashing dead eye. But you're gonna hit Y, B. You're gonna put this outside guy right here on a corner route. You're gonna streak Hurst like this. You can do whatever you want with Andrews. You can put him on a delayed fade. It's really up to you, right? You can ID this guy, double team this guy right here like this. Now, you can motion this guy out if you want to. You don't have to, but you can motion him out. Boom, like this. Roll out, here it comes. Pass lead this up, boom, there you go. And then you get yourself this really nice cover three bomb. Now, weirdly enough, right? The 95 speed um, takes a moment to get there. Again, you can do whatever you want. You can do this concept right here. You can put him on an out route or you can streak him, drag him like this, right? But nonetheless, this one is gonna be a little bit harder to get off, but nonetheless, you're gonna be able to go here, roll out, throw this guy there, boom, pass lead this up, and then be able to hit this guy right here over the top. A lot of times people do not expect this to come. So there's kind of a universal cover three bomb and it really doesn't matter where they're at. Let me go ahead and come back down here. I'm gonna go ahead and audible and put Tom Brady in just because we got hot route master now. So here it is. Now, the part that is great about this, by the way, is again, totally up to you, right? If you were to run this play, like I showed you beforehand, like this, let's go ahead and double team this guy here, motion him out. Boom, there you go. You're also gonna be able to throw this guy up the seam. So two different ways to run this cover three bomb. What is great about this, right, is I'm gonna go ahead and go to tight end shake and notice how Kittle's already got this short pass play right there. Now, totally up to you, but now you can put A on a post route like this. You can block your running back, you can drag Y, and you can put X on a streak, right? You can even motion him out like this or you can bring them back in. Nonetheless, you can put them on a streak, there it is. And then what you can do is you can motion this guy out. When he gets really far out, boom, boom. And you can throw it right here as well with this tight end shake. One thing that I need to mention is this play right here is great when you're gonna double team. Blocking the running back in this formation like this just doesn't work very well. So make sure to audible like tight end shake or something else that's just a little bit better. So there's a play out right there. Motion out Kittle. Boom, there you go. Boom, throw it out there. And then you're gonna always pick that up every single time, especially if they're in a cover three. They're in a cover two, that's a different story. But if they're in a cover three, you're gonna absolutely bomb this every time. So let's go tight and shake. If they're in a cover two, you're gonna hit the drag to Hurst. Obviously with Mutt now, you've got so many, let's go see if this will work now. You got so many opportunities to have really fast tight ends, right? Motion them out all the way, boom, there you go. And you can see that we can throw this up here and boom, hit this corner right there, right on the post route. And the streak is gonna pull it out. Now if they run a cover two, 
okay if people come out let's say a cover two now right let's just go ahead and run a cover two you can honestly run double crossing routes and double drag routes and just pick one to user so there it is double crossing routes drag route hit y underneath pick up five six yards or wait for them to clear out just a little bit and you're going to be able to hit these double crossing routes this isn't the most ideal scenario but it's a very uh let me go with this play right here uh there it is Right, so you can see right here, boom, boom. You're gonna see how X is gonna get wide open over here. And the other one, you're gonna be able to, you're gonna be able to hit it in a little soft window as well. So you can see against the cover two, you do have double crossing rods to help you out. Um, but the best thing about a cover two, right? Let's go bring these guys back in. Is this play called tight end corners? Tight end corners is super effective. You can see right here that they both have deep corner routes, right? And for example, let me just streak both of these guys. You really have options to either side. So check this out. Boom. There you go. Right, you're gonna notice right here if you roll out, you're gonna be able to hit this guy right here every single time against the cover two. Really, it's gonna destroy it every time. Let me go ahead and go to this replay. Boom, right here. Let's go ahead and press. Tight in corners like this. Again, streak. You can drag Y and then you can put X on a trail route like this. This is another great setup right there it is double team this guy right here boom roll out look y is gonna get open a is gonna get open and then x just sits there so you kind of have like if the user goes out there x is coming across and he just stops which allows you to throw it to him right away there it is so really simple scheme guys and don't forget you have the dive right if they're not going to be pressed if they come out in a 4d lineman set you can run the dive you can run the stretch you can audible back to goal line you can auto back go back to gun heavy panther and then run your qb blast which we know is a very popular formation bring this guy in and then roll back out here damn look at tom brady bro this guy is fast bro look at this guy right so you can see if guys are going to come in and run man to man you can audible to this uh, gun heavy panther you can also run the same concepts here you know as before you can run mesh set if you want to um you can motion this guy out put this guy on a post route like this bring him back in and then there it is you got the same cover three bomb boom roll out and go ahead and hit this guy come on get there let's go brita come on baby so you can see you got yourself plays that you can utilize so hopefully you guys enjoyed man just a little ace double wing cover three bomb mini scheme and gun panther heavy where you can utilize the both with that being said i'm out take care capiche